Hey guys, Tech Mitchell with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to change your phone number on your iPhone and explain what that does for you. So let's get started. So on the latest version of the iOS here, it's going to be really simple to change your phone number, but you have to keep in mind about a couple of things when you do this step, which we're going to explain. But if you're looking to change your phone number, it's really simple. You're going to go into your settings, and then you'll see that there's a phone setting itself. You click on that. And once you click on that, we'll happy to see my number here. If you click on that, there should be a number already listed here. It just says 000, but of course, you want to go ahead and change it to the number that you have. Now, the number that you have has to be the same number as your eSIM or your physical SIM that you're using from your carrier. So whatever you change this number to, right, whatever that is, it has to be the same number. So if you're putting a new SIM card, it should automatically have filled it in for you from your eSIM or your physical SIM card data. It gets automatically populated. But in a case that you're changing your SIM card or you just got the new number and it didn't update here, you're going to do it manually to update here. So once you're done with updating it, right, just hit save here. Your number will, will be saved there. Now, once your number is saved there, now a couple things will happen. What that number does when you do save it there, it doesn't actually change it on the network. So if you're trying to put a different number than your SIM card, it's not going to really do anything. All that does is changes things like your contact info. So if you click on your My Contact, you'll see that number listed will be updated there. And any apps that require like iMessage and FaceTime will try to use that number if it's a valid SIM number. Any apps like WhatsApp or other apps that require your phone number will take that number and fill it in for you, like a data for it, or if you're filling out like a form online or something that says my number, it will take that number and fill it for you. But to really change a phone number, you can't just do it from the phone setting here itself. You have to contact your carrier that you're working with, right? Your big carrier, the company that you get your phone service, they have to do it on their side to change the number for you. So if you want to get a new number or if you're switching from one number to another number, they have to do it on their actual network themselves in order to do it and then give you that updated one. And if you have a SIM card, they might give you a new physical SIM card that you'll have to insert into your phone. Or if you have an eSIM card, they'll email you the eSIM card information and you can activate it through there, which I have another video explaining how that works itself. But again, like I said, if you want to manually change your phone number, you can do it from here. But keep in mind that this is only changing the data on the phone itself, not at the network where you're receiving calls and texts from. So I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure that like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.